hey guys good afternoon <laughs> i am almost done with tomorrow's video super excited i'm over here with talia this is mama's best bestie all my kids are my besties however this one is just quite clingy firstborns if you're a firstborn let me know if you're very close you have a very close relationship uh, with your mom um yeah so uh tomorrow's vlog is almost done we are having um pork ribs from yesterday's uh, birthday celebration today so no heavy cooking going on however I need to show you guys my closet by the way let me show you guys I need to get let me show you guys from the top I need to get this sorted out like today when I say today <laughs> I'm talking about today <laughs> this is a hot mess I I intentionally put all the clothes down yeah I put the clothes down because I need to rearrange everything from the toes to um, my gym wear all of that stuff that's Talia Talia do you want to say hi okay Talia doesn't want to say hi I did a thing, I wore a bikini yesterday for the first time in years, like four years. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I woke up feeling like superwoman yesterday. Before I go, I wanted to show you guys this product. I just wanted to share how many, do any of you use a freshness deodorant? <laughs> I got this, it was like, it was a PR package. It came in a PR, like a goodie bag. Okay, not PR package, sorry. I got this, um, after while attending an event it was in a goodie bag this is the farm fresh intimate skincare so it's basic it smells it smells very fresh <laughs> yes it smells very feminine it smells fresh um so what is this product this is like a wellness product you spray it down there not like direct contact I personally, I don't even spray, I don't spray it like directly on my skin. What I'll probably, I'm just sharing the product with my online family. So basically, I put on for it to wear leggings, right? I'll put on the leggings and then I do, shh. yeah, it smells, it smells nice. It doesn't, of course, again, I don't spray it directly. I don't recommend you spray it directly. <laughs> I'd like to throw it in my bag as well when I'm out and about, you know, you're just very sweaty doing a lot of these things. You just spray on the clothes and then I think it gives like a nice fresh scent so yeah I just thought I'd show you guys it is by the way it says 24 hour protection okay hypoallergenic dermatologically and gynecologically tested Love's for beginners, ain't no witness. It slips through your fingers. I ain't telling no lies. So oh, F all the drama, F the karma. Just do what you wanna. Promise you, you got time. Be you and keep looking forward. Don't you look backwards and you'll be fine. Come through and say what you need to. Don't let them put you down. same purse three months straight if I really like it talking about purses this one this is a Cameroonian brand online store they are on Instagram Kwa Duala Kwa or Kwa Duala I'll tag them and let me just put it I don't think I'm sure I'll never mention this again on this platform unless I say something is sponsored that means it's not sponsored mean that nobody is paying me to see it I just wanted to quickly say that this purse is gorgeous 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 stuff it is really good quality amazing inside out inside out I'll get more purses from them definitely 
because this particular design has another color that I like. When I love something, I give them a lot of colors. <laughs> so yes, I wanted to quickly talk about this one before I proceed. And when I say leather, I'm not talking about, this is not sheen, this is not like fast fashion leather, this is good quality leather. I feel like this is a handbag that you would own for years, so long as you know. You are a little bit careful with your bags. So look at this beauty. This is a beauty. <laughs> to fall asleep because I feel like my kids can take a trophy <laughs> even if, when it comes to sleeping positions and for Talia this is his birth Talia slept in some very weird positions as a baby and there she is like what why is she on the why is her head down and then the legs are up and about to sign out for the day and then I stumbled on this this is a tweet actually I'm not on Twitter I should probably join Twitter <laughs> um, let me just read it out then I'll share my opinion about it I'm a very opinionated person if you've not noticed but yeah I fully inherit some types of beef because how can you continue to befriend and fraternize with someone who deliberately caused a lot of pain to a person you love. This is so me. I accept it like with my full chest, 100%. You hurt, you hurt somebody that I love. You see this whole ideology? No, let me get to know you for myself. The way you treat A is not the same way you treat B. Hmm. First of all, the people that I love, like the people I call friends, the people that are dear to me, family, and then the people I choose to call family, there's blood, and then people that you choose to call family, aka friends, right? I really am invested in my friendships. You hurt my friend, you hurt my Family, my relative, family member, you've hurt me. I'm sorry. I don't want to get to know you to be a judge of character. You know, I will take what you've done to my friend. I know that my friend will, is not perfect. My family member is not going to be perfect. However, that imperfect person has stood by me through thick and thin. Yes. Mm -hmm. They've been there for me. You know, they've uplifted me, they've poured into me something you have not. I'm really wondering what I'm trying to get to know you for when the person that has done all of these things is still doing all of these things. You've hurt them. 
do you guys get where I'm coming from? You know, many people be like, no, I don't inherit beef. I have inherited beef <laughs> in the past and even argued with somebody on social media. And then many years after, that person I argued with on social media because I was inheriting beef, she is, I wouldn't say she's friends with that friend I argued on her behalf. Am I making any sense? But they are very cordial and since the day I agreed with that person on social media till date, no, like, I could be in the same space with them, but I don't, if I walk in and already, even the hello, I won't say. That's just me. That's what I choose. That's how I choose to act, right? I just wanted to get you guys' opinion because to me, that's part of like I said, I'm big on self-care. Self-care is a lot of things for me. Self-care is also what I feed my brain with. I always have these spontaneous topics on my Instagram, by the way. A family page, home of the Gere News. So you might as well follow me on there. My stories are always lit because <laughs> I always share strong opinions on there. But yeah, I would inherit beef. You hurt somebody that I love. I'm sorry. I will side with my friend, my family member, is like, you cannot you cannot bring gossip to me about a friend or about my sister, my brother. Again, I'm sorry, I will not entertain it. The first three sentences that you make, I need you to communicate and give me the point. And very straight to the point, by the way. Boom, 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 boom. I have a really close friend of mine, I call her friendly. So be like, hi Dolly, this is this person. She did this to me, I didn't appreciate it. So that the first three sentences you've made, I've understood your, I've understood clearly what you're trying to say, why you are bringing it to me, even though my second point is going to be, have you told her? And if your answer is no, I'll be like, why are you telling me? <laughs> and maybe if you're like, no, it's because, you know, for some reason, I'd like you to talk to her. I'll be like, okay, um, I think you should talk to her about it. However, I can bring it up to her, but you cannot say negative stuff about my friends just tell me what she did to you and bounce move i'm already on my friend's side 100 percent. like that is me um they say in this day and age you don't say you're a ride or die kind of friend mm -mm, mm -mm. i have people i've been hurt i've been burned friendships have burned me hurt me a lot of healing some of the friendships they'll never go back to where they were before even with family members that family members are, i'm not close and we are not as close as we used to it happens right i mean i'm freaking 30 30 years on this earth <laughs> so that's to be it happens sadly and then i have people we've been through ups and downs but i know till date that if I call them, they will show up. 